What's up, y'all? Y'all already know we back with another one. But today we're going to get deep. I just wanted to go over a little topic today and just talk about how to push forward under pressure. You just, sometimes in life, you're going to go through things, whether it's your business, whether it's your personal life, whether it's whatever. But you have to push through, no matter what. Because it can become a little bit overwhelming. And it's like, it'll make you want to give up. It'll, it'll make you want to just be like, you know what? I don't, I don't care about nothing. But you can't do that. You got to push forward because there is something that's meant for you. If Ms. Johnson would have gave up years ago, she wouldn't be where she's at today. If I would have gave up years ago, I wouldn't be in this very moment like where I'm at right now. So all I'm saying is through difficult times, you got to push through. It's going to seem like, you know what? I can't deal with this stuff no more. And I mean, it could be overwhelming, y'all. Like, I mean, to the point where you like, I just want to cry. But it's going to come a time where you can't cry no more. Now it's like, okay, what you going to do about it? I understand what you're going through, but what are you going to do about it? So you got to get tired of being sick and tired and you got to push up, right? And you got to push. You got to do what you got to do to make something different happen. If you're doing the same habits, if you're doing the same thing, you're going to get the same results, period. Yeah, man. If you, Believe it or not, I used to be on the streets. Yeah. Okay. And not only me, but Tamika as well. So we both have stories where I know you hear people say, oh, I was homeless and I didn't have nowhere to go. Well, you know, it's levels to this whole I was homeless thing. Okay. Some people say, oh, I was homeless. That, mean, that means they was house hopping. And then some people say I was homeless. They Their ass was really outside and they had nowhere to go. Mm -hmm. That was my story. And that was her story as well. Okay, like we never really got the chance to really sit down and tell our whole story because it's a lot <laughs> that I went through in my past and it's a lot that she goes went through in her past and sometimes you just don't feel like going through all of it and reliving um, the pain. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? So we only we only talk about it surface level. Like, yeah, I was on the streets. I nowhere nowhere to go. That type of situation. That's what it was. Okay, for me and her we both experienced the same thing and we had to push through you know because at any time any given time we could have just gave up mm -hmm. there's people out here that commit suicide they just you know they can't take it no more can't take life no more mm -hmm. right and especially right now the suicide rate is going up because people are stressed out yeah people are stressed out because really because of money mm -hmm. because of these damn bills and this inflation yeah. It's driving people crazy. I've been seeing people on YouTube crying, like stressed out. Like I seen a nurse one time crying because, you know, she make quote unquote good money. Her husband make quote unquote good money and they still can't make ends meet. Okay. And I'm sitting back thinking of it. I'm thinking God that I started a business back in 2018. I'm like, damn boy, because I would have been effed up right now if I had a J-O-B. No shade to the job but the the average jobs here where i'm at i don't know about nobody else's situation but the math ain't math it just let you know right now <laughs> you the math ain't math you get two of them bad boys and the math still ain't math it that's right all right man. and you ain't got no life no more because you got to work from sun up to sundown now the reason why you get to see me and tamika on these videos is because we have created a cleaning company that we no longer have to physically do the cleaning in we just you know we we're, we run a cleaning company um, this is my studio office and right across the hallway is my cleaning company office and then in that room over there that's where we our classroom is but I say all this to say I have free time okay because if I didn't want to teach you guys if we didn't care to start a second business we could have started any fucking second business Okay, I could have started a different second business, but we decided to start a coaching business to teach other people. This is how much we care about you guys. It's just so much, you guys, that this goes into the entrepreneur life. And, you know, another reason why we haven't really done a backstory, because it's like, we be feeling like nobody really wants to hear that. You know what I mean? Because nine times out of ten some people they lose interest in three three minutes of the video right and you want to make sure that everything is good but it's like 
You want to know the people that you're trying to get coached by. You want to know what's their story, right? It's so many people that are going through so many things and everybody has their why. Like, seriously, y'all, like, we just like you. There is no difference between you and I, but our experience and where we're at right now. Like, Miss Johnson, she started this business. I just tapped into her reality in 2021. She's been doing it since 2018, y'all, okay? So, me just tapping in and trying to understand this whole entrepreneurship world, I don't see how she's been doing this from 2018 by herself because it's a lot it's a lot you know what i'm saying like, it's challenging y'all mentally it's physically emotionally like and if your numbers ain't right you're gonna go through it i mean you're gonna go through I it i can only imagine the people that are building businesses by themselves because I, I started building my company by myself and I had the help of my teenagers. But, you know, as far as the business side, that was all me, you know. And it's a lot of different moving parts right, y'all. in a business, y'all. Right. It's, it's, it's so many different variables. That's why a lot of people start and they don't last in their cleaning business past one year. Yeah. Okay, let alone they, they don't make it to six figures. And six figures is not even a lot of money. Yeah, But it's a lot of money if your ass ain't got it. But when you get it, you understand what I'm talking about. Right. <laughs> Y'all, like, Miss Johnson tell people, like, you got to get focused. Like, please, like she say, turn your TV off. Turn off all distraction because you're going to have people, nah, 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 nah. you're going to have people in your ear telling you how no. much you can't do this, how much you can't do that. You're going to have people trying to discourage you through the whole process. You know what I'm saying? Like, I ain't trying to get emotional on this video because sometimes I do because I know where I come from and where I am right now. And I know I deserve to be here. And you do too. Y'all just got to take time out and let things go. Like, stop letting people stop y'all. What What is it? You feel intimidated? Like, don't, don't worry about it. Don't worry about they it. Don't, they're scared to invest to get out of this situation that they're in. I Everybody's that. trying to hold on to a little dollar. When you, you don't understand that money... It's very important, but it's only just a tool. Yeah. You can utilize money to get you to where you need to go at. I have had to invest thousands of dollars into coaching. Yeah. Because I said, you know what? I need the education. Not only that, but I need the accountability. You know, we just hired a coach and she told me everything I already damn knew. But I needed the accountability. Because now I know on the next call, I got to get all these things done. And she going to think I'm bullshit. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Yeah, that's true. Okay, so I'm just saying, it, it it really does help. You need some help. If you already had all the answers, baby, you will already be a multi-six-figure earner. You will already be a seven at seven figures right now if you already knew all the answers. So yeah. if you don't know the answers, you need to hang around people that do know the answers. Reach out to those people. Hell, if you can't invest in coaching, get buy, pay for a consultation. Something, you, you know, know, join a commu a Facebook community for free and get ask questions help. or something, yeah. you know, but literally get some help, you guys. Yeah. Get I, some I, help. I know y'all trust is broken with people because people talk a lot of smack, you feel me? You know, especially how people treat you on in the streets. You know, yeah. you got friends, family that you're supposed to look at as a representation before you step out here in the streets. And if your family treating you some type of way, you're going to feel some type of way going into the streets like you on guard, like you in survival mode. Right. Well, you ain't got to be like this, like with us. You know what I'm saying? Like, just like, just try us out. You feel me? Like, for real, for real, we're able to sit here and we literally, like, took the whole day off and just shot content all day. Um, we just want a contract. It's another six-figure contract. So, woo, 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 woo. But, you know, this ain't nothing new to us. Like... We win contracts all the time, and we go out to eat, we celebrate, you know, but we, I, I'm, I'm just grateful and thankful that I don't have to bust a sweat to pay no bills. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? And this is what we're teaching people. And uh, frankly, my, my main point of this video right here is the shit not getting no better out here in these streets. At all, Okay, Rent is as high as it can be. It ain't going down. But it ain't going down. No time to car note not going down. Okay. And the math ain't mathing with these damn jobs out here. I'm telling you. I done went on Indeed and I was like, damn. I just hired a guy. He said he was making $13 an hour. And and literally, I <laughs> we hired him that same day, didn't we? Mm -hmm. I ended up calling him back and I said, man, just meet me at this, this building tonight, man. God damn. Because I didn't even know people were still working for 13 and you know he got a, a kid to take care of by himself and all that and his story sometimes people's story just really be touching me and i'll be like man oh lord just 
Just come on. Just yeah. come on. Damn. Yeah. Just when you think your story is something deep and heartfelt, and yeah. you hear somebody else, and you you be thinking that you're going through the ringer, boy. Right. You and know, then people don't. It's, it's like some people would do better if they knew better. I you well. Know? Let's 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 put a pin in that because some people know to do better and they choose not to because uh, they might be scared and they don't know because people are scared of the unknown mm -hmm. because they don't want to invest on the thought of something could change. But you got to know that you are going to change mm -hmm. and we don't have to sell you anything. We don't even have to tell you. The proof should be in the pudding. Like, I know y'all be looking at us sometimes and we be having on our tenacity shirts and that's because we be a little bit comfortable. We try to make you feel comfortable, right? Because there's some people out here who be dressed up all the time and they selling you a whole bunch of dreams, yeah. right? We try to come to you, come to as you as real we are, as you know? possible. Yeah. All right. Like we not the YouTubers driving around in the, in 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 the uh, Bentleys and all the you know stuff. The flashy stuff is cool. Mm -hmm. No shade to the flashy stuff. Now, right. Okay. Because when I get on that Bentley lifestyle stuff, <laughs> all right, I might I might I might have to cop me one one day. You feel me? But that's not what I want to lead with. I don't right. want to lead with the luxury lifestyle. I really would rather lead with value. That's okay. it. Okay, that's, that's what I want to lead with. That's it. So you know? I hope you guys understand this video. Like, even under pressure, you still got to push for you, forward yeah. and just lead with value so people can understand who you are, what you're doing, and why you're doing it. Yeah. Okay? All right, y'all. That's our message for today. We really just had a nice little rant. That's all. <laughs> That's all, because we miss y'all. Yeah. And, you know, I ain't going to say we ain't got shit else to do, but we just, we got to do our content for, for, for today. And that's all we've been doing all day. We were just kicking it, riding around town, that's shooting content. Mm -hmm. Pretty much the lifestyle I like to live. You mm -hmm. feel me? And if you want to know how to live that lifestyle too, make sure you join our academy. Okay? Go to www.tenacity academy and book your discovery call today. Or make sure you guys come out to our workshop September the 21st. It's my birthday weekend. Yo, woo, woo. We're come and support. Another thing I want y'all to do is if y'all can to comment down below. If y'all have any questions, any type of videos y'all want us to do, just go ahead. We can do a video of a, a, a QA. and a Y'all want to ask us some personal questions? Leave it in the comments down below. We're going to yeah. tune in for y'all, okay? And last but not least, if you haven't joined the Cleaners Club community, make sure y'all join our community, man. Mm -hmm. click the link get inside the community if you can't afford no mentorship or coaching or 101s or the diamond program or anything else that we got mm -hmm. at least get inside the community we go live in the community each and every wednesday night mm -hmm. at 8 30 if anybody watching this and y'all in my community comment down below and let them know how them q a calls be and how right. much value you have gotten from those q a calls okay, okay. let, let them know them. Let mm -hmm. them know in the comments right now, all right? We ain't going to talk y'all head off, all right? We out of here. <laughs>